All right, this morning, uh, crew's hard at work here uh, on the front porch. We took over the front porch from mom. Um, kids wanted to do the seating in the shade. So we brought everything down here and getting all the pumpkins seeded, or not all of them, just uh, three acres worth this morning um, <clears throat> for our early May or early June pumpkins. So to show you what's going on here, you got to start with the empty trays and then neighbor Paul here is filling the trays and uh, getting them nice and level there. And then got a crew here, all the kids and Paul's friend uh, helping over there too, uh, sticking these seeds in. So putting them 50, every tray is 50 pods. Uh, so it's 50 seeds and then they poke them in. Tristan's gonna show us here. That was me. <laughs> so just sticking them all in and then when, when they're done, uh, just a finger, print, a finger whisk down, uh, then they'll just level off the top and then they'll be done. And then we'll take them up to the greenhouse and we're gonna soak them real good. And that's it, and they're ready to go. So he's making stacks of finished ones over here. Um, we need a thousand half acre of each variety right now. So here's the marina. So it's it's 20 trays, makes a thousand. That's a half an acre. And then there's blue doll, that one's ready. And then I think we have Cinderella. There's one, one too many. And this is Cinderella here, and I think we got a couple others we got to do here. So we're getting it done. 6,000 seeds in this morning. There's our professional uh, dirt clumper right there, <laughs> or smasher. The wine's creeper. <laughs> and uh, so getting it done. Picture smile for the camera. It's almost like they know what they're doing or something. I can. You want it? What else do you want to do? I'm not on. Uh, then we have to switch to a new kind. What's up? Then we gotta switch to a new kind. All right, so here Tristan's come backing up here. We're gonna load up. He already took one load up. Um, Two thousand seeds, I think, on the first one we got. Uh, two more trips to make 4,000 seeds here plus another 500 that we did so it'd be total 6,500 but running them off to the greenhouse with the gator all righty we got these uh 6,500 all laid out here uh each group here is a thousand each uh group is its own variety we got them marked um try to keep track of what it what they are so when they all come up we Sometimes it's really actually hard to tell the difference between them uh, or to remember which one's which from year to year. Um, so I got an aisle in the middle here where I'm going to have my hose running up through because we're going to need to water these for the next solid 10 to 14 days, probably two weeks before they're totally ready to plant. It just depends. Some varieties are quicker than others, so we'll see how they come. Uh, my goal is to be ready for this first batch by beginning um, the first week here in June, so like June 3rd, June 4th. Um, be ready to stick these in that's my goal so and then to, in the two days we're gonna do another batch um, and then those will be you know middle of the week that first week and then another batch on Saturday which hopefully will be the end of that end of the next week you know kind of give them a little space in there so all right I gotta get some water on these we just set them down into groups and we're gonna get them soaked real good I'm gonna do that probably twice the room real soaked um, one to hopefully keep the mice if it's real nice and wet hopefully the mice aren't as interested in them in finding them um also it's really hot today so want to get these nice and soaked so the germination can get me in and we can uh, maybe two three days here we can see them popping out so we're gonna get that started so as you can see just yesterday we we got this flower greenhouse completely empty um actually not we got a couple ferns there but that's for my wife and my mom and the one is a finch nest so uh but otherwise it's completely empty and so now we're getting these uh a day later we're getting all these pumpkins we're gonna have this um there'll be about i'm gonna say 15,000 uh seeds in here uh by the end of this week roughly um so it's about seven to eight acres we're gonna have transplanted and then we're also gonna seed some directly but um this floor will be decently full of trays um at least at least three times what i have here so um 
we're gonna have to be pretty faithful here the next two weeks and keeping these nice and wet um, it's very nice and warm and hot in here it's a black black tarp so it really gives them a nice hot bed to grow on but there again it dries out pretty quick too so we'll have to water these um, especially once they they sprout and they're coming up we'll have to keep them nice and wet you know at least two times a day probably um, on sunny days maybe once on a cloudy day but um, so it'll be a it'll be a job but saves a lot of money to grow these um, I don't have any water yet I'm waiting for my son to start my pump uh, down at the pond I thought it was coming but I don't have it yet I gotta wait a few minutes 